So here are some secret tips that can get your home tours to the next level faster and more efficiently. Now, number one is collaborate. Partner with a realtor or two. Each of you shoot two to three home tours, share them with one another, and now you're gonna have six to nine home tours to post on a weekly basis. Number two is gonna be repost older home tours, home tours that fell back on the market or had recent price drops. If it had a price drop, I would even advertise the price drop on the home tour so that you can potentially get more leads. Now, if you have any videos that went viral by your means, right, five, 10,000, 20,000, 100,000 views, I would try to squeeze as many leads from that home tour as possible. The market has already validated that to be a great home tour, so I would repost it again. Oftentimes, it'll actually do better the second time around. We had a home tour that we once reposted. The first time around, it got about 50,000 views. Right now, it's trending around 300,000 views. It may even get more than that. Number three, be careful with owner-occupied properties. So this is more of a precaution. We typically only want to shoot vacant and staged properties, and you're always asking for permission. But for owner-occupied properties, just be careful because there are personal belongings in the home, and you don't want to be advertising that for the world. Number four, use home tours as a networking mechanism. Yes, you're gonna be asking for permission. What I like to personally do is tag the realtor or maybe share the home tour with the realtor. You start to build relationships. They now want to prioritize your offers or prioritize you to host their open houses. So this is a great way to provide some value to other listing agents. Lastly, this is really important, message your followers. Don't just expect because they're following you, they're gonna reach out to you when they're ready to sell or buy. That's not the case. They're waiting for you to extend a hand. They're waiting for you to acknowledge who they are. So on a quarterly basis, I recommend reaching out to them. You can run certain campaigns, right? Uh, you can start with, hey, thank you for following me campaign. Then you can start with inviting them to an event. You can start with uh, educating them about interest rates cutting or dropping or certain things that are happening in the real estate market, but you should always be trying to provide some sort of value and acknowledging your followers. They're not going to reach out to you likely because they're just following you. They're waiting for you to acknowledge them, to reach out to them, and then they're gonna be much more receptive.